Uh, have you seen Izzy at all this week or not yet? Nah, man, I haven't seen the fucking China man. How about you? You talked to Izzy? We just went to a traditional smoking ceremony here. It's like something for, you know. Were you smoking dick or was it like a. No, it's I think for like the, the First Nations culture here and stuff. They oh. were doing like a ceremony Why introduction. Was he there? I don't know. It was I all the Aztec fighters. I thought he's fucking Chinese. Was he there? He was there. Why was he there? I thought he's Chinese, bro. What do you, what do you, what do you do to be a Chinese? You go to re-education camp. Here's the thing about Izzy, guys. Izzy is the definition of fucking spineless. That man will jump on any ball, any bandwagon that a fucking that does him good. You know, look at me. Look at me, the man of the people. When Australia was locking up pregnant women, was I not on the, the interwebs and the tweet tweet before Elon took it over and I got banned? Was I not saying, hey, that's wrong, you guys are arresting pregnant people. Those fucking Uyghur Muslims, when they're getting, I'm sorry bro, I'm, making, no, I'm, being, good, I'm being aggressive. You're good, you're good. Oh man, I'm being aggressive. I didn't want you to unplug the mic. I thought about coming hard again, right? <laughs> but you know, thinking about China, man, I always talk about China. China, the government of China and the people of China are different, man. Re-education camps during COVID, what did you guys fucking do? Lock people, star people. Izzy being the Chinese champion, I thought he would step the fuck up and, and speak for the people, but he didn't because he's not the Chinese champion, he's a Chinese government whore. But China, man, I'll be your people, bro, I got you, man. You know, I got you guys, I'll speak up for you. Yeah, you're under arrest in relation to incitement. Incitement? Yeah. What's that? Yeah. What on earth? Yeah. Excuse me, what What on earth? Yeah, just put your phone down. Can you like record this? I'm in my pajamas. What's I this? I had an ultrasound in an hour before Yeah, I'm pregnant. she's pregnant, so... Well, I'll take it easy. It's in relation to a Facebook post, in relation to a lockdown protest you put on for Saturday. Yeah, and I wasn't breaking any laws by doing that. You nothing. are actually, you are breaking all. That's why I'm arresting you. How do you feel about kind of being the honorary Aussie here? Because it feels like you're walking down the street, people are trying oh, to get man. photos with you. Bro, you're, fucking, you're enjoying yourself. Looks like I, you're I guess. A bit of fun. I guess that just means how much people hate Izzy, you know. But uh, no, it's good, man. You guys are all good fucking people, man. You fucking Aussies. Uh, well, it must be talked about. It must be talked about. It must be talked about. You guys did throw a pregnant woman in jail over a Facebook post during COVID. That must be talked about. Shame on you guys. How do you feel about that? Me personally? Yeah, how do you feel about that? Which woman was this? You, how do you, it was all over the news, man. How do you not know that? You know, Here's the thing, Australia. I would like you guys so much better if you had a freedom of speech. So if you could, uh, if you could go ahead and, and make a freedom of speech like the greatest country in the world, we would get along better. I mean, how is that not standard with you guys? How do you not have a freedom of speech? Well, there's a bit going on in MMA. We've got other sports going on. Yeah, but it's, it's but it's like, but you as a country, as a whole, like you literally, like you you have a government could say, if you say something we don't like, we will throw you in prison. Like, how the fuck do you rationalize that? Are you confusing us with Russia or something? No, I'm con no, I'm not. I, I'm saying that there is a pregnant woman who was thrown in jail during COVID. I mean, who who else? Do you guys remember that? Anybody else remember that? He fucking remembers that shit. That was all over the fucking news, man. So, and again, I love Australia, and I love the Australian people. But, but, you guys have done some fuckery, and so is America. But I think the moment Australia gets a freedom of speech, I'll like it more.